Hello, my name is Elsa. I know my ponytail has been cut. First of all, I start with applying foundation all over my fruits and face. Dabbing it in with my damp beauty blender, it's gonna spread all over very well. How pretty this is making me! I am applying this also over my lips and my neck area. Then, using my translucent powder and a very fluffy brush, I am going to set my whole face and of course also my neck. and beautiful and all made up takes so much work now with my jumbo pencil in milk I am going to form the shape of my eyes and make them all bright very big and very shiny Then with a flat brush and light brown powder I am going to line my new lower lash line. Once in a while I take a look at my picture to see how I did my makeup in my movie. Using a smaller brush I'm going to define the middle part of my eye a little bit more. Then with a very very thin liquid eyeliner pencil I'm going to line this very very smooth. Ooh, must be careful, because I was a little bit shaky there. applying to, I'm gonna start to work on my outer corners and my inner corners with a very beautiful purple color. Then with a small makeup applying brush, I am gonna take a Bordeaux color to line my upper eyelid. These 
special corners that I do in my inner eye, that is to make me a little bit naughty. Now with a clean brush, I'm gonna start applying more of that beautiful purple on the in and outer corners of my eyelids. Once I've also made a little line on the lash line, I'm now gonna apply beautiful shimmery white in the middle of my lids. Then applying that same white beneath the normal eyes to make me that really beautiful popping cartoon eye. Of course, finishing up is always necessary, especially with these thin lines. Oh, and every little mistake can be corrected with a little Q-tip. Getting very pretty, isn't it? Filling in this little tip makes my eyes even more pretty than they already are. Now I'm gonna curl my lashes because falsies will be applied later on. Not to miss, then apply a beautiful coat of mascara, but not on my lower lashes. With a flat brush and brown eyeshadow, I'm gonna draw in my brows, but as I always make that crazy frown, I'm gonna do them different on each side, so that it looks as if I always have that frown on my face. <laughs>
didn't do that, I would always have to make these buddies notes. Now with concealer, outlining the real lips will give me the opportunity to make my beautiful, small, pinky, glowy Elsa lips. And of course, this has to be tabbed in very well, or you'll have those white lines all the time. <laughs> Yummy! A tissue! With a flat applying brush, I'm gonna build up with very, very beautiful, shiny pink lip gloss. But it has to be many layers because it's very, very sheer. Creating smaller lips isn't as easy as making them bigger. Keep my lips beautiful, visible, beautifully visible actually, I am gonna outline them again with concealer and a very soft applying brush. Now that's a thick line, of course it needs blending too, that would have been a silly idea, leaving it like that. Now I look as if I've just been drinking milk. lip gloss I'm now taking the applicator itself and going over it one more time taking some lash glue and what a bunch of lashes it's about time to apply my lower lashes my milky pencil again, I am gonna make my eyes even more white and big. Also those shiny spots have to be a little bit more vibrant. How pretty is this? As I'm living in the cold, my cheeks are oh so blushy and also the tip at the bridge of my nose, I'm oh so blushy.
from cold, but I don't mind. I had applied some glue on my upper lashes beforehand, so now they are tacky enough to be placed. This went very well, don't you think? Now I've gotta let this dry a bit before I can apply them to the inner corners. Just apply some blush to my forehead too, cause it's cold up there also. As I'm completely ready, I want to thank you all for watching. This again was part of my 30 days marathon of every day another video. So, if you aren't subscribed yet, please do so. Give me some thumbs up and give some comments down below. And for now, look at me, how pretty I am. Taking a little bit of weird faces again. Haha. <laughs> All for me that's left to say now is look at my beautiful eyes and my frown and thank you all for watching this video. And I hope to see you again next time soon. Bye bye.